Hi everyone, the Spider-Man here. I hope everybody's doing okay. So guys, I'm going to be doing something a little bit different today. I'm going to be going outside and looking for a UK beetle that I've never actually seen before. It's called a Devil's Coach Horse and my good friend Mark Strantlers, he actually seen one and put one on his channel. So please check out his channel, absolutely fantastic video by Mark. I'll leave a link in the description below. So Mark told me that they like to hide under, under rocks and under pieces of wood and they like to come out in the winter months. So let's go over to that field and let's take a look. So guys, there is the main road that you've just seen just and there is the trees and behind them trees is the actual field. So let's just walk along here and here is the entrance to that field. I've been coming over here since I was little and I used to bring my kids around here and we used to uh, feed the horses when there were actually horses around. There's no horses anymore which is a little bit of a shame but uh, yeah as you can see guys it's all woodlands and there's grass everywhere and trees and hopefully a devil's coach horse. It's always nice to uh, get out in the fresh air so I can't promise you guys, I might not be able to find one, but uh, there's always a good chance that there might be a few lying around or walking around. So let's uh, take a look around and uh, hopefully we'll be uh, very lucky. So guys, I feel like uh, Steve Backshaw <laughs> in these woods. So let's just lift this up, see if there's anything behind there there's nothing there at the moment but uh i've only been here a couple of minutes or so but there's always best to have a look around i've never actually uh seen one in the flesh before um i didn't even know what they were until a couple of years ago i was just uh, having a look around on the internet and uh a devil coach horse came up but um, yeah, there's nothing around here at the moment, but uh, there's still plenty of places to have a look around. So guys, let's just carry on down this walk path here. Very muddy. I should have um, put my Wellingtons on. And uh, them are the fields that you've seen at the uh, start of the video. We used to call these the Sandies. This was uh, a nickname for this area when I was growing up. But uh, I think across there is uh, a giant pond. So I don't want to be swimming anywhere today. <laughs> so yeah, let's uh, take a look up here and uh, hopefully we'll get lucky. So guys, Mark did say that you can actually find these devil coach horses in dark and damp places but there's nothing around here around here guys it's all just grass really there's not many rocks or pieces of wood lying around but uh you yeah, know i'll keep looking i'm not gonna quit just yet because i've only just come out so i really want to find one and i have my um catch cup ready guys there we go. So if I do find one, I'll put it inside there. We can take a closer look. Mark did say they are very, very aggressive and fast and they're not that keen on the light. So I have a catch cup ready and waiting. So there's nothing around here. But uh, yeah, any time will tell. But like I said earlier, guys, um, I might not find one, but... Uh, it's always uh, best to have a look round. So guys, I finally found a piece of wood. <laughs> Let's have a look under here. Uh, nothing round here. Well, like Mark said, they can be very, very aggressive if they're uh, provoked. But uh, uh, nothing beyond there. But uh, yeah. Never mind, I'll continue looking around. And typical guys, it's just started raining, oh my God. So I found 
Another piece of wood here. Let's have a, a quick look. No, nothing behind here. Another piece of wood there. Oops. No, nothing behind there, guys. Let's just put this piece back and continue with the search. So guys, unfortunately, no luck at the moment and the uh, the rain's getting worse and worse so it looks like I'll have to head back home very, very soon. And uh, I've done something very, very stupid. I didn't put my Wellingtons on. <laughs> so it's, uh, yeah, it's not a very good idea coming out to a muddy field with no Wellingtons on. Well, I'll, I'll do that next time. Uh, there's another location I can go to. There's an actual park, which is around two miles from where I live. I'll, like, I'll take a slow walk there. But there's a lot of rocks and a lot of wooded area around that that park. But uh, yeah, I'll go around there in the next couple of days. But I'll still take another look around, guys. I'm not going to quit just yet. But the title does say, I am searching for the devil's coach horse. I didn't say I was going to find one. <laughs> So, um, yeah, it's, uh, it's a hit or miss, really. You know, you might find one and you might not. But, yeah, I will definitely uh, go to that location in the next couple of days, to an actual park. But, uh, yeah, like I said, I'll uh, keep searching around. So, guys, let's just have a quick look around here. There's a bit of a piece of stick there. No, nothing, nothing around there. Oh, I'll be so disappointed if I can't find one. But uh, there's plenty of places to still look around. If you look at the, the field, it's absolutely huge. And this is where I used to feed the, uh, the horses and the cows with my daughter when she was little. She's uh, a little bit old now. She's nearly 22. <laughs> so, yeah, let's just uh, keep having a look around. I can't, unfortunately, I can't find any, any rocks or anything at the moment. But if I do see one, I'll uh, definitely have a look. Uh, nothing at the moment guys so guys I found this huge piece of wood here so let's just try and move this out of the way if I can uh, nothing at the moment Sorry, keep going out of focus, guys. No, nothing at the moment, guys. So, guys, the weather's getting really, really bad now. So, I'm going to head back home in the next five minutes or so. So, let's have a look around here. Oh, there's my first rock. Oh, my God. How can you get excited by seeing a rock? It's my first one I've seen. So, let's have a look. And nothing. Oh, my God. But uh, that location, number two, guys, there's loads and loads of rocks around there. I know there is, because I've been past it so many times. But no, nothing behind there, guys. Let's just lift this side up. No, absolutely nothing. Oh, well, never mind, guys. I'll search around for another five minutes, and I'll head back home. So, guys, unfortunately, I found nothing today. But this is my last shot here, guys. So let's just lift this huge piece of timber up we've got anything under here this is the last shot for today guys but i will be going to location number two in the next couple of days and unfortunately nothing guys never mind oh well i'm not going to quit there i'll definitely not quit there guys so 
I'm on the last trek of this uh, adventure, just going back home now. So guys, unfortunately I didn't find nothing today, but uh, I didn't promise anything, but uh, yeah, my catch cup is empty. So like I said earlier guys, please check out uh, Mark's Tranchlers. I'll leave a link in the description. He actually found a devil's uh, coach horse in his location, but uh, yeah, I do apologize guys, nothing today, but please stay tuned for location number two. I will be going there in the next couple of days. And thanks for watching everyone.